Hi folks, Dr. Bob McCauley, How to Get Fluoride Out of the Body. Check out all my books on audible.com. A couple weeks ago I made a video about uh, decalcifying the pineal gland and uh, you know as both calcium and fluoride kind of coat that over. Um, but why do we want to get fluoride out of the body? Well fluoride's a poison. Uh, they've been putting this in the water now, I think, 78 years or so, and that's the American Dental Association. And at this point, I don't think they'll ever want to remove it because if they did remove it, they'd have to admit that they're wrong. They've been wrong all this time. I mean, fluoride is a poison. It lowers the IQ. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a form of rat poison. So this is, it's got all sorts of detrimental uh, you know, effects on the body. It doesn't belong in the body. And for the amount that you're going to get on your teeth, I mean, it's, it's absurd and they just won't do it. So if you're on municipal water, chances are you've got fluoride in your water and you want to get it out of your temple, the body. So um, I talked about iodine a couple weeks ago. Yes, iodine is an excellent way to get fluoride uh, out of the body and uh, you know decalcify the or the pineal gland so it's, it's all about the pineal you know the pineal produces melatonin uh, when it's they call it the third eye because it senses light and when there's when it's dark out it produces melatonin and you sleep better and then when the light it's light again you produce neoephrine and that's chemicals we need in the brain so we know when to sleep and when not so this is a critical uh, uh, gland in the brain, the pineal, and it needs to be kind of kept clean so it functions properly. Well, it calcifies with, you know, poor diet, and then of course fluoride is terrible for it. So iodine is really good at uh, removing it. Of course, that's your most important is the thyroid. Uh, the medical industry, your establishment, always doctors always want to take this out. I can't tell you how many people have come in here through the years and say, what have you got for my, th you know, for metabolism, not for your thyroid, because I had my thyroid removed. They do that with radiation. And uh, doctors, they just, you know, lo think nothing about taking that out. That's really the most important gland, it would, r what makes everything else work. Um, so, uh, you know, these doctors like to remove organs like crazy. Um, you know, like they're not there for a reason. You know, try, try removing components of your computer, see how well it works. It, they're there for a reason. So iodine is one uh, even better for removing fluoride be boron. Um, there's something called borax. You could go out and buy that. Um, it's a different form of it. Boron uh, is a little bit more pure. I, I sell liquid angstrom boron. Uh, this is very effective at removing fluoride from the body. Uh, magnesium, uh, same thing. You can get all sorts of different types of magnesium. I, I happen to sell liquid angstrom magnesium. It's great for your heart. I always say this, that's your most important mineral because that's your heart mineral. You know, more people die of heart attacks in the world than anything else. It's by, by far, uh, it's unbelievable amounts, way how much higher than cancer. Um, and uh, of course, then uh, tamarind. Now, tamarind is a spice. It's like it comes from a seed that's used in Indian cooking a lot all throughout uh, Southeast Asia. They use tamarind, but that's really effective at removing fluoride from the body as well. Um, you could go through a liver cleanse. Um, that would help um, and, uh, you know, just get the fluoride out of the body. Once you've cleaned out the liver, it's more effective and it's easier to remove from the body. Uh, liver cleanse is, is always a good idea no matter what. But that's just a few things you can use to remove fluoride from the body. It's really important. It is a poison. It lowers IQ. Um, you know, I sell fluoride filters. Um, um, I, it's obviously, like I said, they're not going to be taking the fluoride out of the water anytime soon. Uh, American Dental Association, in my opinion, that's not your friend. Uh, they're being always behind the uh, fluoride in the water and mercury in your amalgam fillings and why well and they claim that's not bad for you or anything another one it dumbs you down you you think this is like some kind of conspiracy or something I don't know anyway those are the things you can use uh, to get the fluoride out of your body there's a lot of other herbs and stuff you can use I think these are four of the best ways to get it out uh, the magnesium the iodine uh, the boron and tamarind dr. Bob I'll see you next time Check out all my books on audible.com.